Oh, another nasty morning out there uh, and it's going to get worse. So let's take an island getaway this morning. Leslie Cater, our travel lady, is with us today. Good morning. Hi, good morning, Bruce. Now we should recognize where you're taking us today because there's a, a fairly popular TV show that has a connection, correct? Right, that's right, The Bachelor. And I know that uh, you're a big fan of the program, Bruce. You never You've miss an episode. following it avidly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who's but, in it? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> the Bachelor. <laughs> but now, last week on this, they, they featured the island of Anguilla yeah. and beautiful places like Secret Beach and um, the beautiful Cap Jaluca Hotel where they're all staying. And I was lucky enough to visit there a couple of years ago. And it is definitely one of those very high-end destinations. Okay, well tell us a little bit about what makes it so unique. Now, I've, I have read up a little bit. It's not the, the biggest of islands, it's about 16 miles by three. Right. Um, but there are some other unique uh, features. Yeah, it's, it's, it's high end. It's kind of the playground of the rich and famous. Um, beautiful area. Now, this is the hotel that we're going to stay at, but we're going to talk about that a little later on, just to set the picture here. Okay. Um, Anguilla being very high end, it comes at quite a price tag. Right. So a week there would generally cost around four thousand dollars. Okay. So, but we want to go and see it, so we're going to cheat a little bit, and we're going to go and stay on Saint Martin, and jump across to Anguilla. Okay. So, so what's the plan? This this is Anguilla, one of the beaches there. As you can see, it's. Um, there's not a mass of people there, mm -hmm. um, extremely high and beautiful as people have seen from The Bachelor. Going into St. Martin, however, it's just a, a half an hour ferry ride from Anguilla. You can see St. So Martin. So go spend the day, is that the idea? Go and, yeah, stay on St. Martin because that's going to be cheaper. Mm -hmm. So this is our cheat way mm -hmm. of seeing Anguilla. And then you hop on the ferry, it's $20 round trip to go to Anguilla. You could even pick up a car for the day there, go and tour the island, hang out at the places that Paris Hilton likes to hang out at, because mm -hmm. it's hot. It is hot, and, and, <laughs> and I know the climate is hot too. Uh, yes. the, the temperature is hot too. How much, uh, how much do we save by doing it the way that you're presenting to us this morning? Well, you'll save a couple of thousand dollars, because if you compare a week on Anguilla, probably around 4,000. Mm -hmm. With us going into St. Martin, we're looking at around uh, 1,900, so under 2,000. And that's gonna include, that price is gonna include your stopover hotel in Toronto on the way back. Because unfortunately, we don't quite make that connection. Okay. St. Martin is beautiful in itself, as I know, oh, I know you know. Absolutely so it gorgeous. Would be a great trip. Do you know I read that there are 130 species of birds on Anguilla? You know, so you it might it might be worth going just to bird watch. <laughs> You're so knowledgeable, sure. Bruce. That's why I love these interviews. So is Wikipedia you, very very knowledgeable. <laughs> <laughs> Great to see you. Thanks for coming Lovely in. Great to see you too, Bruce. Uh, Leslie Cater, the, uh, the travel lady, taking us on a unique uh, holiday today. Call her if you'd like more details on this one or any other trip, 277-6884. Check out our website, thetravellady.ca.